Good morning, everybody. We're at Big Lagoon State Park, and we're doing a little pop-up campground. Because we gotta go to the beach. It's ready, beach time. Ready to go to the beach for Big Lagoon State Park. What do you think, Baxter? It's time to go to the beach. Samantha wants to redecorate again. Why well, do you want to redecorate again, Samantha? Uh, just want to, you know, freshen it up a little bit. It's been a couple of years since we decorated it. I get it like that. Yeah. Don't show them this bed. I didn't make it when we, uh, when we popped it up. <laughs> point, point it the other way. Point it the other this way. This is our storage right now. Backpacks on backpacks. Yeah. And the bed's messy over there. But it's time to relax. So we got here last night, set up the camper. It was so muggy and hot, this camera would not even film. It was literally fog the whole time I was trying to take like video. We got it popped up. We got our camper in a spot. Camper in spot, is that a word? We got our camper in a spot and uh, we're just sitting here on the beach enjoying the afternoon. This crazy storm is coming in. It's August and it rains every afternoon here on the Gulf Coast. It's like mon it's like our monsoon season. Samantha and them refused to come get underneath the awning. Come help us get the stuff. Refusal. Hopefully it doesn't blow our way or a little tarp. So Big Lagoon State Park is like over here by Perdido Key, just that down from Pensacola. Awesome little spot. Kind of like not really talked about. Big Lagoon is a state park where you can have. You can camp, you can, uh, there's a boat ramp, a lot of places, there's a lot of campsites where you can just put your stuff down and go and check out the area around, like Prince Bill NES, watch Blue Angels, the Air Museum, you can go down to Rio Key itself, a lot of cool bars down there, and the wind is about to muffle out this microphone. But I wanna thank the Scammy County Sheriff's Department. Yesterday, y'all were awesome, helping us with a family emergency and search and rescue you guys are awesome thanks a ton everybody appreciates what you guys do here for us on the gulf coast thanks a ton uh, we're packing up here i'm gonna hide under these little pavilions there's really no other way we can go if we go back to the camper we're just gonna sit in the camper in the storm and at least here we've got a view Raving the storm. Look at this. Under the palm trees in the California sun. Sand underneath our feet. The morning's just begun. I don't remember much from the night before. This is the difference of camping with a Yeti. Locked not locked. We're cooking a uh, dinner here at the camp. Camp Motley slash Brown. Some over there. This is ours over here. Sarah, do you have soap in the camper? No? <laughs> He's cooking from afar. Are you on chicken duty? Yeah, I'll watch it. You're on chicken duty. So, we're cooking dinner right now. Samantha's got the vegetables on the barbie, which is, we just split some wood on fire. Just cooking the vegetables. Samantha is doing the charcoal grill, which she's dropped two pieces of chicken, so she's fired. I am now cooking the chicken. And uh, I'm looking for a top for the pot that we're cooking macaroni in, because no campsite is official without cooking macaroni and cheese. I found it, I found it. Get away from that. Get it. Check this out. It's ready to go. Let's walk it up the hill. Come on. You can do it. What are you doing, oh dude? God, he's so bad. What are you doing? Oh he's invading the campsite. <laughs> you want me to grab him by the tail? Yeah, do it. Do it. Dude, come on. Baxter, you didn't even bark. What kind of guard dog are you, Baxter? Huh? One eye, that's what he is. He, he's as deaf as an armadillo. Samantha's cooking breakfast. 
think she's eating more than she's cooking. Fruit, yogurt, and granola. <laughs> Coffee. So, you know, after a weekend of pop-up camping, I don't think I have ever seen Samantha as happy as she is in that little camper. You know, that pop-up camper has been like a cool home away from home that we can kind of decorate, renovate, however we want, as weird as we want, with whatever we want, and it's a no judgmental zone. And that's what the great thing is about pop-up camping. You can go anywhere, it's light, it's manageable, it's pretty easy to set up and take down, and we can just be whatever we want, wherever we want, grab it and go. That's the beautiful thing of it. You know, we haven't shown all the trips we've taken in that pop-up camper, mainly because we need our time too. But there's still great times and we have enjoyed them. But if you ever get a chance, check out Big Lagoon State Park. It's a cool docking station to be able to see the rest of that part of Pensacola, Perdido Key, Orange Beach. It's a good spot. But tomorrow, we're redoing this. This is gonna be a screen room. I'm pretty pumped about it. Concrete's going in. We're redoing the concrete. And this is gonna be like one of the inroads of our rehabilitation process of this house. This old 1947 house. Samantha got her booths built this weekend. Looking good. First cushion covered. Looks like it's from Tunisia. I don't know what that means. She's doing her cushions. Now she's just got to paint them. I mean, whoever thought of kitchen table chairs, booths instead of chairs. Even when I was a kid, I always loved booths. I always wanted to sit in the booths, not the chairs. I always wanted to sit in the booths. Now I've got my own booths. It was Samantha's idea. Big old piece of bacon. Yeah, thick old piece of bacon. Yeah, extra thick. Yeah, it's got a piece of bacon. Ooh, that's yummy. Be careful when that's underwater. <laughs> it's a landmine. 